वी आर डिस्कसिंग प्रॉब्लम नंबर टेन पॉइंट एट ग्रेड ट्वेल्व वेव ऑप्टिक्स चैप्टर सो दिस इज अ प्रिटी इजी प्रॉब्लम इट इज अ क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू ब्रूस्टर्स लॉ सो बेसिकली दिस इज अ रे ऑफ लाइट विच इज कमिंग फ्रॉम एयर एंड इट इज गोइंग इन साइड ग्लास ऑफकोर्स इट इज गोइंग टू रिफ्रैक्ट इट विल बैंड टूवर्ड्स द नॉर्मल बट वी ऑल्सो नो दैट अबाउट फोर परसेंट ऑफ द लाइट गेट्स रिफ्लेक्टेड सो दिस इज द रिफ्लेक्टेड लाइट बट at a special angle of incidence which is known as the brewster's angle or it is also represented by theta p angle of polarization sometimes it is also called this angle would also be theta p but at this special angle brewster's angle the refracted ray and the reflected ray they become perpendicular and the reflected ray becomes fully polarized this becomes fully polarized now you can check with the help of the polaroid meter over here you can just turn and you will be able to find out that this is polarized completely now we know that tan of theta p is equal to refractive index of the second medium where we have the refracted ray so that is the refractive index of glass with respect to air okay so this is the brewster's law now we are supposed to find out this theta p for air glass interface so tan of theta p that is equal to refractive index of glass with respect to air is 1.5 yes had it been this water then you will have to take refractive index of glass with respect to water so in such in such case i will have to divide this by the refractive index of water which is 1.33 so if i find theta p that is equal to tan inverse 1.5 i will get this answer approximately 56.3 degrees but this you have to remember this is with respect to air of course these all angles will change if you will take the above medium as something else